Uh, hey, look, bro. I was just playing some COD real quick. You know what I'm saying? And I, it had me thinking. You know, I feel like some days you just got to decompress. Some days you just got to just realize that everything is just going at its own pace. And there's only so much you can do at one time. You know? It's important to put in the work. It's important to put in the effort. But it's like, at the end of the day, some things are just not even in your control in the first place. You know what I'm saying? It is what it is, though. You know? I'm literally just over here just cooling like nothing ever happened. And I'm really going through it. I'm not going to sit here in front, act like I'm not. But at the end of the day, bro, I know that every single day I'm doing what I need to do to improve. So that's all that fucking matters. <laughs> you know? Because you can literally sit around for hours and just wrap your mind around millions and millions and millions of different scenarios on what could have went right here, what could have changed this. But it's like none of that shit matters because time is a continuous thing. It's going to continue to flow until there is no such thing as time. So it's like really at the end of the day, bro, like I'm just you just got to take every single day, day at a day, day by day, day by fucking day, you know? maximize every single moment that you have because at the end of the day you're not going to have it tomorrow and you'll realize what i mean by that in a couple of years or maybe at the end of this video or maybe even right now but real talk fam i'm over here just catching dubs and shit you know <laughs> clapping niggas <laughs> uh, just chilling bro just enjoying life honestly Cause you know, could be worse. It could be better. But at the end of the day, every dog gonna have his day, and that's what I rest my mind on. Cause I know for a fact, one of these days I'm gonna have every single thing that I want in life. People are gonna say I'm cocky. People are gonna say I'm proud. People are gonna say that I didn't deserve it and that I'm lucky. Because they don't see all the unseen hours. They don't see all the tears that I cry thinking about <laughs> all the things that I've done wrong in my life and wishing I could have been stronger in certain areas to help out people that don't even fuck with me and didn't even fuck with me back then. But that's just a testament to the man that I am, you know. I'm just a go-getter, bro. And that's how you got to be because it's kill or be killed in this world, bro. Everything is symbolism, bro. Look at the animals and how they live. We're just like them, but just more sophisticated, more intelligence. Same thing, though. The most alpha fucking lions fuck all the female lions. <laughs> the most alpha lions kill all the fucking wildebeest and eat all them niggas. The most alpha lions kill all the other beta lions. That's how it is in real life, bro. My bad. I'm washing some clothes, too. But uh, that's just how it is, bro. It's kill or be killed, bro. You either make yourself into the strongest being possible and dominate in every single area, uh, area of your life as a man, or you fold, bro. That's the only two options you have. You can't sit around and complain and bitch about your anxiety like females can, bro. We don't have that luxury. We don't have the luxury to just sit around and fuck around all the time. You got to make something of yourself, bro. But at the same time, life isn't just all about the grind. It's also about just enjoying the things that you do have. Like, I'm blessed, bro, to be able to play this PS4 over here. It's a blessing. You know what I'm saying? It's a blessing. Even despite the situation that I'm in and how I feel about myself in this current moment, like, I'm still blessed, you know? And that's the mindset you got to have, bro. You got to look at the things that you do have in this world and not focus so much on what you don't have because if you continue to wrap your mind around stupid things like that things that don't matter things that are out of your control you're just gonna literally kill yourself <laughs> literally you know can't change everything bro but you can if you change yourself remember that shit because no one's gonna take you seriously Unless you can take your own self seriously and make people take you seriously. 
like I said, man, one day at a time, bro. One day at a time. It's honestly one of my favorite Bible verses of all time is this. And I'm going to share it with y'all just because I believe the Bible does have a lot of good references and, you know, good life lessons and stuff that are applicable to anyone, whether you believe in the Bible or not. Literally says, worry about the things of today for tomorrow has enough troubles of its own. Which basically means stop being a little pussy and thinking about how you're going to eat tomorrow. How are you going to fucking put gas in your car? How are you going to pay your fucking insurance bill that's straight through the roof? How are you going to pay bills? How are you going to make it to the next step in your life when everything's trying to hold you back? Because at the end of the day, you don't know what the next two years is going to look like. So stop worrying about the next two years. Worry about each and every single day. And eventually that will add up to the new two years. The next two years. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I feel like this time period in my life is really teaching me patience. Because I'm going to be honest, I'm a very impatient person. And I believe that there's, you know, a fine line between both that you have to have in your life. Because you have to be a go-getter or else you're not going to accomplish it. Unless you have a sense of urgency. But at the same time, you have to wait for things to develop because everything is like a seed, bro. You just got to keep watering it. But enough being said, I'm about to get back to this call of duty. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> but uh, yeah, man, I just figured I would share y'all um, just how I'm feeling. But then at the same time, like as an encouragement, you know, that like everything isn't what it seems. I know I'm not the biggest YouTuber right now, but it's like at the end of the day, bro, anybody can come behind this fucking screen and act like there's somebody else that they're not. But I'm never going to do that. I'm always going to keep it transparent. If I don't feel like posting a video, I'm not going to post a video. Other than that, I'm not going to allow myself to go more than one day without posting a video. So it is what it is. I take days off here and there just because like I'm fucking stressed, you know? We're all humans at the end of the day. It's time to become superhuman. You dig? Let's go. All right. I'm out of here.